Have you ever wondered what connects chromosomes, DNA, and genes? These three tiny structures carry the code of life. In this video, we'll take a simple look at what they are, and how they work together inside every living cell. If you're curious about how your body really works, hit that subscribe button and join us for more easy science. A cell is the smallest unit of life. It's like a tiny building block that makes up all living organisms. Most human cells have a nucleus, and that's where the real magic happens. The nucleus is the control center of the cell. It doesn't just manage cell activity, it also stores genetic information. Inside the nucleus, we find chromosomes, and chromosomes are made of DNA. Each chromosome is made of one long molecule of DNA. When a cell is ready to divide, the DNA coils tightly and forms a familiar X shape. That's what we call a chromosome. DNA is the molecule that holds the genetic code of life. A gene is a small section of DNA, and each gene carries the instructions to make one specific protein. These proteins are what make our cells, and us, who we are. DNA is the molecule that holds the genetic code of life. A gene is a small section of DNA, and each gene carries the instructions to make one specific protein. These proteins are what make our cells, and us, who we are. Each human cell contains 46 chromosomes, that's 23 pairs. Each pair carries the same types of genes, one from the mother and one from the father. Sometimes, people are born with an extra chromosome, which can lead to certain conditions or syndromes. The 23rd pair of chromosomes decides your biological sex. In females, both chromosomes are the same, that's XX. In males, they're different, 1X and 1Y. This tiny difference plays a big role in human development. Now we know how DNA, genes, and chromosomes build our bodies. But what happens if just one tiny part of this code goes wrong? In the next video, we'll explore genetic disorders and how one extra or missing chromosome can change everything. 